and Everest here. <laughs> I am back with another puppy haul. Now all of the stuff I'm about to show you I got from Chewy, my favorite place to shop. This is not sponsored, not, not affiliated with them, but I really do love Chewy.com. Seriously, love them. <laughs> anyway, Black Friday just happened and Cyber Monday, but I think it was kind of like a Black Friday, Cyber Monday deal thing going on with Chewy and I bought a handful of things and I got two different boxes here. It doesn't seem like a lot. I thought I got more. I'm not really sure. Anyway, Everest, you gotta move, darling. She's just here playing with her puppy. She has this little stuffed puppy. Anyway, let her go do that. First thing, let's get the big giant thing out of the way. You guys will probably remember this from the very last haul. I got her a bed, another bed. So I got that original bed. Now I have that in my office and she loves it. She lays on it. Uh, so that was going to be for the, the crate, but now it's not. So I got one for the crate. Everything I purchased was on sale, uh, whether it be a percentage off or a dollar amount off. Everything had a little sale going on. So I took the opportunity to get a few things that, you know, we will need in the future. So we have the pet bed. It's the same exact one. It's the Frisco, uh, what is it? The large pillow pet bed, the 40 by 28 by four inch. Really am loving this bed so far. So it worked out that it was easy. Anyway, hi Ev. <laughs> so I did get a collar and a leash. So I already have a leash. Can you not eat the leash? Thank you. I already have a leash. <laughs> This is gonna be a difficult video to make. So I already have a leash, but I kind of, I wanna keep one in my car or have an extra, actually I should've got another leash. Stop, no. Uh, because, you know, I don't wanna accidentally forget it or anything like that. So I wanna keep one in my car and then if I'm ever, cause I, I stumbled, can you stop? Can you stop? She is crazy. This was the worst time to start filming a video. <laughs> I got a collar because she doesn't have a collar. You guys know I've been preaching it. I've been a harness girl. I love harnesses. So you're probably like, why? Can you not please eat this? Okay. I'm sorry guys. I'm not really going to be able to show you, but these are both Frisco, I believe. Yeah. Then Frisco nylon dog leash six foot and the Frisco nylon dog collar. Anyway, I got a collar because sometimes I do find myself, I have been finding myself washing her harness and she has to go out. We live in an apartment complex, so I have to have a collar on her. And um, we don't have one. We have her small little one that she got when she was a puppy because the rule of the Humane Society was that you had to leave with the collar and a leash. And I didn't have a collar that fit a puppy, so I had to buy one there and it was just a teeny tiny little thing. So anyway, moving on. Why do I have a feeling this is, you know what? Here, play this toy. <laughs> anyway, I did get this for Ember. This is a little turtle catnip toy. Kong refillable, premium catnip refillable cuddly fabric toy. Ow, oh my gosh. Seriously guys, it's the puppy tooth phase right now. She is, she's in the process of getting her teeth, losing her teeth. Uh, anyway, we have the catnip turtle. I am looking at it right now. She's pretty excited, but she's not gonna come and get it because the dog's down here. But I think that's just super cute. It was, it was a good deal. So I figured she needs a new toy because Everest has been chewing up all of hers. And then last thing in this box, I ended up getting this turtle uh, squeaker mat. <laughs> Jeez. She's like, what? I thought this was this was a pretty decent size. Uh, it's by Zippy Paws. I do really like Zippy Paws products. I got them a lot from my cattle dog and their squeakers and all that stuff are, are entertained her for hours. So uh, this turtle was pretty cute and it's a flat mat. It just has some squeakers. Let's see if I can get this out of the bag. She's gonna take it. I'm gonna try not to let her have it yet, but it's just this little, little turtle. It's so cute. I think this is a little a good little toy for her be able to chew on it. It seems pretty, pretty tough. So that's all that was in that box. And then on uh, this box. I'm sorry, I have a lot of boxes, guys. There is a, also a vegan food haul coming soon. Can you stop, please? Thank you. <laughs> so this box is full of stuff. Let's see what we can start with. So you guys probably remember this ball from the last haul. I actually have it right here. One second. The purple version of this. It's a really awesome, it's called the Kong Squeeze. She loves it and it makes a fun noise. <laughs> okay, get it. Uh, so 
I got another one because this is really awesome. This is like a really good product to take to, like we have a dog park here in our apartment complex, so um, it's one of those, that can wash it if it gets nasty and you bring it back in the house. And it's really, it's durable and I like how it squeaks as well. I think it's really cool. And they come in a surprise color, so we got red this time. I like their red, it'll be easier to find. So anyway, moving on, I did pick up, I always say pick up. I bought some greenies. She is um, currently eating the puppy greenies. I don't give them to her very often because I'm not a huge, huge fan of greenies. I want to be able to make, I want to make my own treats and all that stuff. But these are really great for, you know, cleaning her teeth and all that stuff, aside from when I clean her teeth. Now these are the regular ones and they're for dogs, 25 to 50 pounds. She's not quite there yet, but they were on sale. So, you know, future for the future. And how many are in here? 36, there's 36 treats in here. So I went ahead and got those. And then greenies, I don't know what, I never really was a huge fan because of the, all the ingredients and stuff, but my cat, cats at the time, like Sahara loved them too. We just, they, they die for them. They will die for them. And even Everest is starting to be like that. And I did pick up this as well because this is like the specific fresh breath one and hopefully she'll like these. I'm actually very curious. It's the same regular 25 to 50 pound dogs. There's only 12 inside. I really, really did want to try these, especially for those days when she has really bad breath. You know those days. Yeah. Anyway, another thing that I got was this, the Turbo Scratcher. I actually have one of these. It's the, the same brand. What's the brand? I don't even know. Oh, it's Turbo by Host by Coaster. Turbo by Coastal. I have the star one, which is actually, it has this ball right here and it lights up as it spins around. Everest spends hours at that thing. She loves it. I got this one. I was debating, like I wanted to get, they had the star one, but it wasn't on sale. And this one was on sale. I think this was, I don't know, for some, she is scratching in a box. For some reason I want to say it was like $3 off and she just spends so much time at it and Everest, <laughs> I'm getting my animals confused. Ember loves it so much as well. But if Everest is at it, Ember can't be at it because they just don't, they don't share very well. And I got another one to put on in another room or whatever, probably in my filming room or some, or my office. And I did get refills for the center because Everest, my best little, little friend here, huh? My best little friend, my best little friend. She likes to unwind these. So she's already unwound the entirety of the other scratcher we have. It actually doesn't have the scratchy thing in the middle. <laughs> it's just empty right now. So I had to get some of these. I actually should have gotten more of these. I wonder, I wonder if it's too late. The sale's probably over. So what else do we have in here? Oh, my darling. No, no, no. I got this. So you guys know I have been, I love harnesses. What did you grab? Did you grab something? No, you didn't. Here, 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 here. I love harnesses. That's, that's, stop. I recommend to everyone who has a crazy dog, a dog that pulls, a dog that's not leash trained, whatever it may be, a no pull harness, you guys. I tell you what, they, I have seen these things work miracles. Yes, it might not, it will not work for everybody. A no pull harness will not work for everybody. But I always suggest that you try, oh my goodness, crazy girl, come here. Go get it. So I always suggest that you try this first before you take any other route. It may seem so like weak and measly, just like this little harness, but I've had, oh, sorry, there's a dog chewing off my fingers. So, okay, let me talk while holding the dog. So, I've seen crazy dogs, big dogs, so, like when I say crazy, I mean crazy pooling dogs. I've seen everything and it, these just are like magic. I don't know how to explain it. Personally for me, everything that I've seen. I, I mean, yeah, there's been a few times where it didn't work for people that I suggested it to. And I'm no professional or anything, but I always say, try this out, seriously. And this one specifically, I have this for my cattle dog and I had this for my Husky back in the day. And she, can you stop? I think she's settled down now. <laughs> my hands are bleeding. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm bleeding. <laughs> Whoops, anyway. <laughs> Sorry if you're a little queasy. Uh, anyway, 
Gosh, I've been trying to explain this harness thing for like the past 30 minutes. Oh my gosh, she's just getting into everything. I really have to go faster. I recommend this. Give this a try if you have a crazy dog or if you plan to what, really train your dog. What is she? She's like climbing on all these boxes. Try it. <laughs> That's all I'm gonna say. So anyway, moving on, I only have a few more things in here. I actually did pick up one of these. These were my cattle dog's favorite. This is by Outward Hound. And it is just the fire, fi I always said firehouse, fire hose fetch. This is a really tough toy. Um, it also has a squeaker in it. And these, these actually were something my cattle dog could never destroy and she would destroy so many things. Can you not ever <laughs> So I got her one of these because I wanted to try it out with her. And she is now in the box of stuff. Okay. <laughs> I ended up picking up another bag of those flatties. So the squirrel, the raccoon, and the fox. They're just flat, you know, you can, I had them in my, literally had them in my last haul. I got another one because they were a really, really good deal. I am like bleeding everywhere. <laughs> Oh my gosh. And then I did pick up some more springs for the cat because the last bag of springs, she ate them all. Like not ate them. She didn't eat them. She might have eaten a couple pieces. <laughs> I, I think I caught her before she got too crazy, but she did chew up quite a few. And the cat's really sad because she doesn't have any springs. And then I did get her, I'm trying to move this out of the way. I did get her a tire. I've been wanting to get one of these since she was a puppy because I knew these are really good. I have heard nothing but good things from these. And these ones you can actually put treats in apparently. This is the Kong tire. And she's ripping up paper bags there. Cool, at least she's occupied. So <laughs> this is just the, what is it? The medium large size. And it's actually, it's it seems pretty decently durable. I don't know, we'll have to see, she's crazy. She actually has a tire that she plays with at an, another dog's house and she really, really likes it. So she should like this one. But that's that, that is everything that we got from the Black Friday, Cyber Monday, Chewy sale. And I think it was a pretty good haul. I kind of wish I would have picked up a little bit more but oh well. <laughs> I want to thank you guys so much for watching. I would bring Everest in to say goodbye, but I don't want to bring her back because she's going to fight me. <laughs> anyway, thank you guys again so much for watching, and I will see you next time.